Hey guys and welcome to another pet battle video. In today's video I'll be showing you how to beat Arcantus from the world quest Mini Mana Fiend Mully. This world quest rewards 13 polished pet charms. Let's get some information about Arcantus, shall we? Ar Arcantus is a level 25 magic pet which uses 3 magic damage moves. You can only use level 25 pets to beat this battle since it doesn't skill. Which means you can put level 10 pets in your, in your party, but he will still be level 25 no matter what. Dragon Kin pets do extra damage against Arcantus, and Mechanical pets take reduced damage from Arcantus since he only uses magic moves. Also, do note flying pets take increased magic damage, so make sure you don't use any of those typings. For this guide I'll be using 3 Dragonkin pets. The reason I choose these 3 specific pets is because my pet damage will be increased damage against him since uh, there are Dragonkin moves which he takes increased damage off and I have some DOT skills in between as well as an area effect which cancels his area effect. Because it will replace it with the newest one cast. So, let's get straight into it. First, I'll be using Dragon Call, my second skill. Because we want him to set up the AoE, which happens now. So now we're gonna do Scorf's Earth to remove his... And then we're gonna keep casting Shadow Flame until we can use another Dragon Call. Unfortunately, we couldn't cast it off, but that's completely okay. We're going to the next pet. With this pet, I'm going to start off with Cataclysm. And because of the weather scorching earth, he takes some DOT damage, which he died too. So that was it for this cat. You don't need to use these specific pets. You can also use similar pets. That's completely fine, but this is how I did it. And it was easiest for me. As you could see, I barely needed to use the second pet. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like the video and to subscribe to see more of my videos. I'll be uploading videos of all sorts of games I play. So make sure to hit the notification button to be notified when one goes live. I also have a Discord server which is uh, a link to it is in the description below. Feel free to join and talk in there and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.